Hello everybody, Biffa here. Welcome back to City Skylines Industries. So we've got all of the factories now in our city and we need to try and help our citizens to get around much quicker and much better. I was going to say betterer. Yeah, that's a word, that's a word. We need to put in more mass transit. We've got quite a lot of mass transit in our city. We've got metros, we've got monorails, we've got motorways, of course, lots of road connections and things like that. Uh, train lines. We've pretty much used everything. Um, but this part of the city here, let's take an overview, actually. If we take a look. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Before we do that, we're going to see what our traffic is. So, 77%, 78%, put it on fast speed, 79%. It's going up, 78%. Let's say 78% is our traffic. Yep, average. Good. So, if we have a look at this one here. So, what do we have? What do we have? Well... We've got two loops around here of our metro and with a station in the middle, if you remember here, Corrigan Station or something? Yeah, Corrigan Station, there we go, that connects these two loops together. Let's go back to that view. So there's this loop down the bottom here and the loop up the top here. I don't know what this is. Uh, something's happened to a train line somewhere. I'll look at that later. There we have passenger trains. We have one down here, one there. This one's a cargo train. One up here. So we've got those dotted around the place. They're cargo. Running along this area. So Voidford Square where our new factories are. That's what we did last episode. Running up and down this road here. We of course have. There we go. The monorail system. Which is servicing all these people in here. And that runs all the way down here. Between the highway. All the way to the end. But then once they get over here, there's nothing much to help them get around to this section, to this section, to here. Um, this little section down here, Nutty Hills, you remember, is only able to get through via the toll roads. Let's just quickly see. Oh, look at that. 106,000. Wow. 100,000 a week. That is our factories, that is. That is our factories. Uh, let's have a look. Income from toll roads. So, you know, I mean, we're making... Hardly anything from the toll roads. I've got to be honest. Um, we haven't got the whole city blocked off. Once we're getting up to 100,000 a week, who needs 500 quid from toll roads? But there we go. Our factories, 55,000. That is humongous. That is huge. So most of our factories are quite happily running full up. I mean, this one said it's short of something. But yeah, that, they'll be over here soon. And... This one here, it tends to fill up with unique factories to a certain point and then it empties. As soon as there's enough for some trucks, off they go. We can see them all heading out. They don't all stop at the cargo station. Most of these here, if we have a look at these orange trucks, um, own a large warehouse, return to facility, go into a shop. So a lot of these will be going to a shop. They're exporting, they're returning. So yeah, some they export, some they send into commercial areas. So that's the way that's working. But anyway, yes. So going back to our metro, I think we need another metro in this area here. And we are going to start it by... Hmm. What's that one there? Is that another bus? Oh, look. There's like a little... Oh, I know what that is. Ah, oh, that's the one that should be over here. Look. If I move that over here... Uh, let's grab that. It's not going to let me do it, is it? Ah, that one used to come to here. So something's gone awry with our trains. Let's grab... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at this. Chock a block with the trains. Goodness me. Yeah, it's this orange one here, isn't it? That's what it is. Can I grab that and then drag a line all the way up to over here? Yes. There we go. So that now goes all the way around there, all the way around there, up to here. Excellent. I don't know what these weird... Okay, I'm going to fix that another time. But I want a metro up here. So let us put one between this train station and that monorail. I mean, along here would be good. They could walk out there, cross over and get to it. They could walk over here, cross over and get to it. Yeah, I think there. So let us grab that. We're going to go for this one. Does that go straight onto the side of the road? Yes, it does. So if we just sort of put that there yep that's fine and we've got a bus stop there as well 
And then let's see how we're going to run this. So let's just take a look at... So I don't want to put it into Nutty Hills. Although, I've got to be honest. For 500 quid, I may as well put some other sort of... Yeah, I'm going to put one down here. I'm going to put one down here. I mean, some people are going to avoid the toll roads. But to be honest, it's 500 quid. Can I squeeze one in there? Can I anarchy that in? I can... I want to anarchy it up against this road here. Oh, I'm in entirely the wrong menu. That's why. Uh, that one there. Do I need an anarchy to get that in? No, I don't. We'll have that right outside. There. Yep, that fits in nicely. So we'll have that one there. So we can connect those two up. And then, what have we got? A lot of business here. We've got all these offices. We've got all these houses. So we're definitely going to want one, let's see if it comes up there and into Beano Square. One in the middle here will be fine. Everybody will be happy to use that. So could we, if we did an angled one. Mm, yeah, let's do an angled one right there on that corner. There we go. Yep, so we can connect that to that. And I want one down here. For this IT place. So that can just butt up against here somewhere. That can fit in there. Yep, yeah, we can connect that. And then, what should we say? Another one in here. And then here somewhere. Here and here. Yeah, I think that would be a good idea. Let's have a look. Let's get this corner one again. Yeah. Does that fit in right? No. Let's try that again. Yes. How is that going to connect? Yeah, it's a short stop, that one. But And then I want one in here as well. It's going to be weird trying to connect all of these together. Do we need one in there? No, maybe not. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do, actually. I'm going to move this one. That is going to come down here. No, I'm going to change it entirely. Get off the screen. That is going to be deleted. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry for your trouble. Let's fill that in again. Let us put one of those straight ones down here. In fact, would that angle help get things lining up? Like that. There we go. Perfect. That should be okay. And then we're going to have that one go up to there. Let's just follow this round. Oh, yeah, we've got the, the notification thing on that we need so we can get this hooked up. That can go to there. This one can go to here. Just making sure those are connected okay. Yes, it is. This one needs to connect to there. Do we need another one over here? What have we got? We've got the factory. We've got some people living there. Got some shops. No, that'll be fine. People can walk from there over to here. Yeah, let's just keep it as it is. So we're going to go from here. Nice and straight. Yeah, we need to put in a straight bit here, don't we? Let's get this going. So we go to there for that one. Go to there for that one. There we go. We get a nice little corner piece in there. Cool. So that goes around there. And then this one's got to connect to both sides of this. Well, that one's not going to be too bad. Let's run that one over. Yeah, that'll do. And then we'll connect that one. There we go. Excellent. And then this one here. I mean, we could connect that into there as well. But we may as well have it coming out the back. So if we sort of go like this... I level that up with that one. Like that, maybe. And then a couple of right angles, and we should be good to go. There we go. Perfect. There we go. So that covers that area. And we have the monorail right there. Train station right there. So anybody down here is using the monorail anyway. Yeah. 
I think that works out quite well. Let's add in our stop. So we've got our clockwise one first of all. That's going to go around to there. That's going to go around to there. Yep, and that's going to go back again. Excellent. That colour will change. Will it change automatically? Maybe not. Let's have a look. Uh, where are we? Metro lines. So that's that one. Let's have a look at this. And we can change the colour. Refresh name and colour. There we go. The number five line. What do we want to call that one? Let's close these. So nerdy side. We'll call that nerdy side clockwise. That one. There we go. Nerdy side clockwise. Yep. That works well. And then we'll go for a nerdy size counterclockwise as well. So that's going to come around there. That's going to go in there. So I'm hoping that's going to help with the traffic over here. I'll also get that train line sorted out in a sec. I'll do that off camera. There we go. Excellent. And that should help as well. So that's this one here. So that's nerdy side counterclockwise. Excellent. Right, let me just sort out that train line and I'll be back. Right, I've got that train line fixed up and something I wanted to do over here in our factory area was try and make it look a little bit uh, more realistic, make it look nice and add in um, offices around can help with that. So let us just take a few of these spots that aren't too sort of, yeah, too lumpy and bumpy with the terrain and we can add some offices in. Let's go around that little section there. Because we do have a need for industry. So that's going to start filling that up as well. We're going to take those around there. Uh, not that one. Yeah, we'll take that one on the corner there. There we go. Excellent. And what about down this road here? We can do that. Don't know what's in there. Has that got a one of those power cable things in there? It has. Ah, how did I know? Let's move that under there. Excellent. And we should be able to fill that in. No? Oh. Oh, there we go. We can. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, do we need this power cable running down the back here? Yes, that's connecting us up. In fact, that's connecting through there. Have we got some power through here? Put that under the road. We don't need this across here anymore. So let's get rid of that. There we go. Excellent. And that's about it. We've filled up the needs for our industry. Oh, there's a quick auto save there. I am going to put one down there as well. Yeah, starting to look better, isn't it? Look, starting to look better. Cool. That's a good start. Right, so with our train line in and with our new metro in this area over here, let's just take a look at some of the figures and see how that's going. So the train line I've just added back in again. Yeah, people are happily starting to use that. Nerdy side, nerdy side. Let's just sort this via name. So already, look. The new nerdy size, 306, 222. That is fantastic. And I probably could do with checking some of these. Because like this, 417 passengers. What? Wow. Where's that one? Oh, I know where that one is. No, I don't. That's right in the middle here. Oh, that's the bus loop. Huh. Okay. Do I need to add... Come here. Let's get that in the middle of the screen. Do I need to add more buses onto here? 103. Those buses there are pretty empty. No, I think we'll be okay. That should be fine. We'll leave that one as it is because we've got... 36 vehicles on there already. Mini Gamer Square Local, 13 passengers. Do you know what? Pfft, it's not worth running that one. 21 passengers, not worth running that one. They're going. Sorry, they're off. Uh, yep, tram line's working well. Let's just check there's not stops with hundreds of people waiting on. No, nope, that's going okay. Most trams are pretty empty. So do you know what? We're going to drop that down to eight. These have just got so many, it's nuts. Uh, these hold 180 each. Uh, yeah, they're okay. 
That's going to pretty much empty when that one comes down here. So what are we looking at? Metro, yeah. Let's just see whether they're all going to jump on that Metro. I reckon one more vehicle on here would help. Yeah, because that's filled up now. So let's add in... Four, five, six. Let's make it an even number. Why not? Let's do that. Uh, so which one was that? That was Shadow Square clockwise. Yep, so this one here, 712. We're going to have some stops here with tons of people on, aren't we? No, okay, they're pretty busy. I reckon... Let's add another vehicle onto there. So that was dead spin clockwise. Yeah, this definitely needs more vehicles, look. Three. Come on, go up. Four. We're going to add five onto there. Nerdy side. As we know, that's going so well. Dead spin counterclockwise. That's been service fine. And this one. Oh, yeah, look at that. Yep. So we want five going the other way as well. Excellent. That's good. Uh, train line. I think that's going all right. That's, oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. So many people waiting. Um, yeah. I'm going to double that. We are just not... Don't have enough people there at all. Uh, what's this we've got here? Ferry lines. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we've got loads waiting there. Let's get four, six. Yep, and this one here... Now that's fine. And then finally, blimp lines. We don't have any blimps at all because we've not really gone up into the mountains. And I always seem to sort of, in my mind, have blimps with mountains. Well, now we've added that in, we could also extend our ferry line because we have it sort of going round here. Let's get this one. We have it going round here, but we could have a nice ferry over here to Nutty Hills and attach it with these. If we could fit one in here somewhere, I think that would work quite well. Um, how about down here? See, sort of near the train station if you want to go somewhere else. You can walk into there. Yeah, let's go for this spot down here. What shall we have? What shall we have? Go for like the double size one. Will that fit in a bit closer? Yeah, let's go for that. Uh, let's see if we can connect that up. Let's take this road. It's going to be a weird road connection. And this one as well. That is a weird road connection. Let's get that and make that the same height. Actually, can I lower this down? That would be easy, wouldn't it? Let's just level this off. There we go. That's better, isn't it? And then we get like a little slope up and down where the road connects. Yep, I'm fine with that. Uh, do we need a shop or anything here? Let's put a shop there. Fill in that little gap and go with that. Yep, good. Excellent. Let's give them some water. Space already occupied. Seriously now? That'll do. Excellent. Um, let's connect this up. So if I pause that. And we'll get that connection coming out there. There we go. And we'll get this one going up there. Hmm, should we have it go round? Or should we just have it go up here? No, let's just have it go up here. Let's not... Scooch it round easily, like that, and like that. There we go. Whoops, it means to do that. And then if we add our stop, there we go. We'll have that one in there. Do we have one going the other way? Yes, we do. So if we move that stop to here, and then we can drag that to add a stop that. Are they both going the same way? Hmm. Yes, they are. I'll tell you what. I need to fix that up somehow, don't I? But I'll leave that going for now. <laughs> oh, no, hang on. That's going the other way. No, he's not. He's, he's lost. That's what's going on there. Yeah, anyway. I can fix that and have them go in, have them go in two separate ways, can't I? 
Okay, so traffic is ticking along nicely. I want to do something with this little area over here. Um, let's just take a look what we've got. I'd like to add a casino and a boat museum along here. I think that'll go quite well. Let's just see if we can squeeze in. Is this the boat museum? Yeah, so we get lots of visitors there, which is good for this touristy type area. Where could we squeeze that in? We could squeeze that in right on the corner there. There we go. You can go to the boat museum and see all the ferries going past as well. Excellent. And as you're going past on the ferry, you might say to yourself, I want to go and see the boat museum. That'll be good. Where shall we connect this road? Let's grab that. Um, we're just thinking we have that come down here. And sort of follow this like that. Yeah, there we go. That can connect to there. Excellent. Let's grab a water pipe. Pipe or two for these people. There we go. Excellent. And then also we could fit in this spot. We have the casino. 450,000. Will that go... Oh, I thought that was going to fit right on the waterfront there. Do you know what? If I anarchy that in, it will fit in. Let's go like that. And I'm pretty sure that will be okay. Yeah, that fits in nicely. There we go. Right on the waterfront. Excellent. I'm just wondering whether we could just slightly terraform this area a little bit over here. Let's get our brush set to that size. And there we go. Definitely going to need some trees and things in here, aren't we, to hide all of this? Because even if I pick this one, yeah, it's not going to quite have enough to work with to smooth it all out. Let's just make that a bit bigger and a bit stronger. There we go. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. But there we go. Two more places that people can come and visit. What shall we put? Can we put some sort of park in here as well? We need to make some handmade parks. We haven't done that for so long. We could squeeze a dog park in there. I don't really want to. We've got a floating cafe. Now, that'd be nice. If we could have that over here somewhere. Let's put it somewhere where it's right near a road, and hopefully, if I do that, is that near enough a road? No. How about if I use one of these, and go like this, right from there, down to there. Going to get rid of one building. Yeah, that's fine. It's got a nice floating cafe out there as well. I'm liking this little waterfront over here. It is looking nice. It's looking nice. Let's grab some trees. So what do we want around here? I'm thinking palm trees. Let's put that down and that down. There we go. I'm thinking palm trees over here for sure. Can we just sort of... I don't know. You don't really sort of tend to see palm trees like in huge masses. You know, like a fo you don't see a forest of palm trees, do you? You tend to sort of see three or four sort of dotted around together. Just sort of around there. And then maybe some up here as well. I've tended to not really go for palm trees in this area. But I'm thinking, I don't know, waterfront, casino. Just shouts out palm trees to me. Maybe a few down there as well like that. And then what could we put in there? I mean, we've got need for commercial... I'm just wondering whether we could just run. Let's get this little road again. Run like one of these up here. Yeah, there we go. And then just... Let's see, is this all still within the zone? Yes, it is. So we could just put some small commercial buildings in there. Just along there. We'll see what happens with that. And then I just want some trees along the back here as well. Just sort of finish off. What's that one there called? Small beach. Yeah, that'll do. We'll grab some of these. There we go. People are moving in. Excellent. Excellent. There we go. And just a few along the front. Random. Whoops. Randomly placed. Yeah. Looks better, doesn't it? And you've got a few shops coming in here as well. Touristy type stuff. What have we got? Almost five-star hotel. That almost sounds quite nice. 
and the night in. That is what you want right next to your casino and boat museum, don't you? Perfect. And the money is going up again as well, which is nice. Now, what have we got along here that we could put in this area? Lazarette Plaza. We could have a nice little walk in around sort of Park Plaza. Statue of Shopping. I quite like Lazarette Plaza. Let's pop that right opposite here. We're going to get this one again. That sort of fit down the side. Yes. And that will go straight across. Hmm. <laughs> I want it to go over here somewhere. There. That will do. A nice little area like that. And then what about something over here as well? Oh, there we go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. They fit together nice, don't they? Very nice, very nice. Is there a third one we could squeeze in there? Probably not. Not judging by the size of these things, no. So, you know what we're going to do with this area here? All together now, trees. There we go. That's it. We're not going to get some cars down here by the look of it, but I can change that. So, if we grab this and grab... <laughs> this one here, disable the spawning. Vehicle restrictions, that's the one. So we'll grab this road. And we're going to say SOS, recycling is fine. No trucks. Uh, taxis is fine. No, no buses, no cars. And we'll do that between the two junctions. So that'll do that there. And we'll do the same over here as well. So what are we saying? No trucks. No buses, no cars between the two junctions. There we go. We'll get emergency vehicles down there. That's okay. Excellent. What about along here? I mean, we could still fit some more shops along this sort of front here as well. I mean, I know that now connects into here and it's sort of defeating the purpose of the toll road. But, you know, that's fine. I don't mind that because we've got... Uh, you know, I'm going to fill up this area as well at some point. I'm going to grab all of that. We've got the metro coming in there. Well, I'm not bothered. I'm not bothered. We've got the metro coming in too. So let's just bring this along the front. Not that bit there. I don't want those to change. There we go. Let's just shave that back a touch. And we could just put a few more shops down the front here, couldn't we? Let's grab... that road we get that nice and close can connect to there yeah there we go we'll fill that in don't want anything there go for something there and there and see how that goes that should fill up these buildings here look nice i like these little small ones they're quite cool aren't they excellent what are we up to Seventy-one thousand. we've got over three million we are doing really, really good. Let's have a look at our traffic. Now, I'm not expecting the traffic to have jumped up too high. I reckon... What were we? What did we have? 78. I reckon it probably hasn't changed much. And I'll tell you why. 78, 77. Yeah, because if we have a look around... Let's start this side. There's a lot of areas that sort of struggle with traffic. Like this, for instance. All the traffic coming into the cargo airport queues and slows down going in so that doesn't help uh, over here here we go our other cargo train terminal tons of traffic that's like the only one in the middle of all of this we need to add another well, we've got this cargo train terminal over there but yeah this one's used by most of the stuff this side of the city um this roundabout was causing a lot of problem where the cars and the trucks would cut across so i've deleted that but then it sort of moved the traffic elsewhere as we can see over here so there's a few sort of little things which without adding a ton more connections across the city are sort of unsolvable there's a weird thing here look you see these trucks trucks and cars they'll go up and over and down look i bet these do it no nope, they've gone some are going across, some are going up and over and down. What I've done is I've slowed these roads down to 30 mile an hour. And I made this 80 through here. The same on the other side. To stop them going up and over the highway and back down the other side again. Which is very odd. 
yeah, they're not doing it anymore, which is good. These over here. No, they're fine. They're going off onto the highway. So, yeah, I've sort of been tinkering with a few things in the city, trying to keep the traffic down. But we're going to keep growing. So, hit the big B with the tea stain to subscribe. Be back here tomorrow for the next one. Maybe you can check out the next one on the screen right now. And I will see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.